Okay, let's play second round. I should update this overlay. Okay, second round, boys. It's gonna be burn again. Come, come back. Yeah, <laughs> come it back. will burn ag again. Or well, infect. Infect is fun too. Not. <laughs> I don't know. I think I would rather play against infect. I hate infect, but I'm not playing Chillers main board, so. <laughs> we won the die roll both times. Awesome. That's then, a fine keeper, I guess. Yeah, that, that hand looks really good, actually. I think, at least. So you have, <laughs> yeah, you have, red you have turn one map into repeal of reds, and you also could crack the map, then you have treasure map to block something. He plays oh, a basic this... swamp. <laughs> oh, this combo, okay. I'm not sure which deck he's playing yet. Oh, he could be playing next level F then. That's the fun deck to play. Should I repeal this so he has to sack it? Or... No, no, no. But it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> you just chill out, boys. I have Snap. to. Hang on, I have to close some things in the background. <clears throat> okay. More basics. Yeah. Best mana base. Make sure you're oh. safe of, of wastelands and stuff. Oh yeah, he plays um Anafenza, is it? Is it Anafenza the one I'm thinking about? Um but this one is a combo with Anafenza, isn't it? And and Viseros here. Oh Persist, yeah. And he uh, plays um Murderous Red Cap. What you could do is repeal just this nah. Well just the to thing it or crack the map, I we think. don't care about this. We have to stop the sack outlet or we have to stop the Anafenza. We don't care about the two two. So the question is do we want to repeal the seer as I said before? Or do we want to wait and maybe try to counter the Anafenza? Or you can just at some point play stone and blow everything up. Or you can just crack the map. This isn't this isn't. Yeah. I'm gonna crack the map this turn. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's not only on offense, I know. It can be Melira and they as somebody said, they can also play Blood Artist. But the the basic combo is you have to have a sec outlet, you have to have a card which is either an offense or Melira or something like it. And I guess you need a persist creature. <laughs> the classic infinite no life combo. <laughs> yeah. It, it's yeah. the infinite scry combo. You can scry your whole deck. <laughs> <laughs> now that's that's actually not um not that bad not yeah. that bad because you you basically draw it's it's like a tutor every single upkeep right you, you always draw what you need yeah what am what am i getting a tower or a power plant that's a hard question tower yeah it's always tower because you would rather have multiple towers than or you could play really slow and get um no Absolutely not. Ruins. I I knew what what you were gonna say, and and it's that's I don't think yeah. that's wrong. I think we have to keep Rima open because he could play on Offender here, and um I want to anticipate at end of turn if we don't get to Rima anything. I like that play. Yeah, this is actually a pauper combo, which is what I what I thought <laughs> about first. These are all commons, um, and there is a card. In Pauper, which does this, a similar thing to Anafenza, it says when a creature enters the battlefield, put a plus one plus one counter on some other creature or on un target creature, and you can do the same thing. I, I don't think we care about this, right? No. Well, you can use this to protect the Viserys here, but we don't have any removal anyway. <laughs> and the thing is, if we anticipate, and I mean, repeal on Viserys is not good, and you, if he sex this to give us protection from blue, whatever. But if we anticipate and we draw a power plan, we can O-Stone wipe the board. Yeah. Oh, there are some fetch lands. I thought you might play like... Yeah, I thought, it, it, I thought it was budget, but I think if you play three color budget, you're... <laughs> I, I you're think... screwed, boys. <laughs> yeah, I think you're, you're about to lose, man. I think I would maybe take the repair. I don't know what to put the chalice on because those decks are go mana wise really rangy. I mean, chalice could be put on one just to be safe from something like path. Yeah. <clears throat> but 
then you would blank your map. If you draw another map, then you can't. Do as the long as he draw. doesn't have a combo, Arbiter seems pretty good. Yeah. But do you really want to tap out for Arbiter then? No, that's a problem. But do we want to? I guess we could repeal. It's just all crappy. I don't know. I think Arbiter is um is okay. As a one off, but I I don't think it's mandatory, I just think it's cute. <laughs> it's it's okay, good it's some fucked. games and it's not good some others. If you put a better skull on it, it's pretty good. <laughs> so yeah, is it like a turn three clock? On Monday I put a better skull on Platinum Angel. That was also really good against Burn. Could he he could have company here, right? Yeah, he can. But, but we if have... he anticipate into troll and and he companies, yeah. if he tapped out like this is over. We we have to do this anyway. I mean, if if we just pause and we don't draw land, we'll probably die. Yeah. I mean, what's the worst? Boys. What's the worst he could get? Anathenza. Murderous red cap and Anathenza. No, you can't get red cap. Red cap is four mana. Right. Yeah, lot of this is pretty good. Yeah. What is this in his graveyard? Yes, an Avenza. Nice. Oh, Talaria West can get us our Tron piece. Now we have to do this. We transmute. We have five mana open. We play O Stone. He attacks with everything and then he sacks everything and we are dead, I think. He attacks with... We could also draw uh, an island or still draw... Well, we think uh, if, if he attacks with everything, we block two damage, we take four, we go to seven, and he can sack one, two, three, four, five, six. We would survive one life I think but he probably can play one more creature or sack that and then we would be dead <clears throat> so I think we're dead to him just turning all these things sideways and then sacking everything yeah but what to get yeah that's what I'm thinking <laughs> about to um, West, go. no if you get to Laria West we're dead draw an island we can transmute, right? And no, have... no we can't play that. the island and the power plant. That's the thing. I think if, if we get better, if we take better skull and we draw a land, that would be better than taking Talaria West. Because as I said, if we take Talaria West, we're dead. He just He's just going to attack with everything, sack everything. Yeah. And then we go to one life. So if he has one more creature, which he can sack, we're dead. Okay. Can we play Battle Skull and equip attack? No. No. We can only take one card. Okay. Take but... Battle Skull. Uh, Platinum Angel. Platinum Angel makes no oh, sense. Oh, you can you can sack, sack this this one guy twice, you know? Yeah, that's this I already kind of that. He has yeah. five, He has six sacks, and we go to seven after his attack. <clears throat> But we're taking quite some time, so... Yeah, I, I don't mind the time, because we're gonna lose here if we don't do the right thing. I think better Skull's the right choice. Because there's a pretty high chance we draw a land which is untapped. And Talaya West is just not gonna cut it, because four cards... If he has any creature in these four cards, we lose. Which is likely. Oh, there we go! That's how you do it, boys. <laughs> Now I'm gonna have to take time again. No, just attack, attack first, and then just also. Awesome. We would go to um, we would take seven damage. We'd go to four. He would attack us with a one-one. Uh, can you bounce it? No, no. It, it it is the right play. It is the right play. <laughs> No, no, that's the shocker way, uh, to, way to play it. 
<laughs> the shock trooper away, just top deck drawn. <laughs> After thinking for like five minutes, what am I gonna oh, yeah. do here? You, you just, you just you top deck. Block and sack them. Yeah, probably. Does he want to trade? <clears throat> I cannot answer that question, which was just asked. Uh, what is better, replacement for Snapcaster? Nothing is better than Snapcaster Mage. He's asking about Grixis Delver. Why would you play Grixis Delver? That would be my question. <laughs> do we want to do it right now, or do we want to wait? During, until yeah, do it right now. Why? Oh, we, we could be that to a collected company in response and then him comboing. Yeah. He's yeah he must... should... <laughs> <laughs> oh man, Wolf Tree MTG is really on fire, I think. Like, Yakmas World is a really good spell. He's right. <laughs> you think so? Oh, did he say? Oh, oh, he, he sacked the guy. So the guy dies. Yeah, but he gets to scry. Okay. I think it's okay. I think he should have sacked all the other guys first, but yeah. <laughs> I think it's okay to sack this, this one dude. Okay. To do one damage and have one more scry? I don't yeah. Know. No, he should have sacked it last. Or, like, well, he can't sack it last, but he should have sacked it right now. After Cartel Aristocrat. Generally, for Delva, you don't want to play Delva in a format where you don't can't play uh, Brainstorm. That's that's my point. <laughs> I don't Why think that's true. Do? Like if Deva doesn't flip, then it's this card is just a joke. How did we only go to four? Because uh, we are really skilled, I guess. Oh yeah, never mind. We took yeah. I thought we would go to four. And I think whatever. I think now better skill is maybe a bad choice, because now we can put Chalice on one and play Angel and probably. Locked him out of the game. Yeah, but nobody knew we would drop half land. I knew. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> yeah, sure. I think Sunring Titan would be good here. Okay. Because we could you kill both the screen. Play just just a just a land, top deck a Tron land, play Terror Nage, get Sunring Titan, and kill yeah, and stuff. yeah. I mean that's no. We're gonna we're gonna top deck Tower, obviously. Okay. He he had something, but he didn't play it. He has company. Okay. <laughs> Whatever, it's fine. But we need to land. No, I'm. I think we we'll play better scar. We hold remand. Mm. We'll hold I remand and repeal. I think like playing chillis. No, what? What for? No, just no. Okay. If he yeah, plays a, not, if he plays any good. creature, I want to be able to repeal or remand it. That's fine. Could also repeal the token, I guess. Yeah, we could. Like, we could repeal this token. Why wouldn't we? That's no, yeah, if you play, should I should I remount here? I think so, right? Yeah. It's only sad because, yeah, because we don't use our mana efficiently. Harsh times, harsh times. Yeah. Oh, another remount. Great. <laughs> <laughs> remount doing remount things. Did you play standard during uh, Return to Ravnica? Um, I st started playing Magic like one year ago. Like no. okay, <laughs> I played I played standard during Return to Ravnica and I played Azorius Charm, and I would always cycle Azorius Charm, draw another Azorius Charm, and it would be like, do you oh, so no. sad? Okay, we just, is watching you. Okay, yeah. we just we just lost the game. Oh no, he doesn't. Why doesn't he have Azorius here? Oh, he he misplayed. Awesome. <laughs> he didn't target with the here. <laughs> now we top deck a land and uh, mind slaver. Yeah, please. But then we lose, right? Now we have to generate some life. Oh, Hang first on. Touch doesn't do the trick. How do we not lose here? I think you want to attack. Then you want to repeal the token because then you cycle it and draw a land and then you mind slaver. What? That doesn't make any sense. If you top deck a tower or a power plant, then you spend one mana yeah. to get two mana and play Mindslaver. 
Um, what else can you do? I could play Treasure Mage to have another blocker and get a Womp Engine and play a Womp Engine. Yeah. I could first, hoping to draw something, like a Silent Arbiter. We could first and draw a land plus Spider Angel or something like that. Could do that. Hunter, right? Why can't you get good matchups like well, Twin? To take care of one of the ways you could possibly draw. You also could get something with Trellonage, the, the angel. Or do you want to keep. We don't have enough mana. Oh, you don't have enough. I guess I could put Shallows on. You could play Treasure Mage and Shallows on one, but you don't have a Remand or a Frost. No, I think I want re Remand open. I I'm gonna put Shallows on one against Viserys here, and I'm gonna keep Remand open or First Knowledge. Yeah, that's fine. And next turn we can Treasure Mage, Platinum Angel. Yeah. Or we could Mind Slayer. Um, I don't like Shallows on two that much because then we can't Remand. Question is, are we gonna Remand this now? What does an offensa do? Just let it resolve. Well, if he has a sack outlet. Yeah, then we remount that. Now, the thing is, if he has Cartel Aristocrats and we remount re Cartel Aristocrats, he can replay that. If we remount an offensa, he has to tap all his white sources. Then he can't yeah, play Cartel Aristocrats fine. anymore. Right? So we remount the Anafenza. Be because he has only four white sources, but he has enough black sources to cast Cartel Aristocrat twice. Makes sense. I'm so smart sometimes. But if if he has it, like if he has the other guy to sack out, then why wouldn't he play it first? Would that be enough? He would sack two, he would do I think that would be that would be two damage. It, it wouldn't be enough. He would sack this for two damage, this for one damage. That way it's not enough. Yeah, it just wouldn't be enough. Well. Of course, he has another company. Joel, it's very unlikely that he that he has a way to win. No. Those... Why? why... Hmm. Well, I'm gonna attack. If he used it correctly. Yeah. So we just waste this. Can we wipe this board without dying? Like. Oh, I. Oh, uh, yeah. I could have. You should have said that before. I didn't think. <laughs> I just Sorry, thought dude, about. Like you clicked so fast, man. <laughs> I just wanted to waste the spell, but yeah, we could have. Okay. We could have. Well, we would have still. Is this May? No, actually, this is not May. So we would have taken a lot of damage. Three damage. No, four damage. Three damage. Two. Yeah, but we would not have been able to do it. We would have t taken like eleven or twelve damage. Yeah, play something and then play Coniston for zero and to, just to cry. Yeah, this is what I was what I was thinking about when I was attacking. If he is there a way for him to block and win, and there was. Uh, what did you say? Um, just play something and play Coniston for zero and don't pay and. Uh, we can't Coniston for zero because of Chalice. Oh. Just Chalice. gonna we're just gonna attack with one of his dudes and and kill it. I think because we don't want him to have all these dudes. Yeah. But then some, yeah, one of the damage guys. Yeah. We lose free life, but we take, we get four, so it's a good trade. Oh no, we, it's just equal four four. It's it's weird. He doesn't he doesn't understand his cards himself. Oh, okay. this is target player. Oh, nice. Oh wow. You're gonna lose some life, boy. No, we could we could have done the Viser play. Oh man. Yeah, <laughs> if it's target <laughs> player. <laughs> it's all these cards, nobody knows how they work. <laughs> but I like the deck. Like it's checking up a uh, standard at some point. Uh, or Do we not want to still get the I don't think uh, we get no. the play the angel, play angel, save first. We Just can condescend angel. if we play this. Okay, then just do whatever you do. But no, do I think on... angels were safe, but we attack first, right? So if he triple blocks, we take three times nine damage. Just do it because we are already six minutes behind the clock. I'm gonna play angel first, actually. Because I think he doesn't have an answer for angel. Oh, yeah, he has not. He has path, but we have chosen one. 
I'm pretty sure that you being in Skype does not help my time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm playing super I'm slow sure because. But if we played like I would have, then we are already won. <laughs> okay. We sack the sport and then attack stuff. To root things with mind level as you're supposed to do. Yeah, I think if he had just done this last turn, he would have been fine. I think he would be, uh, he, he would bring us down to like free life now. If he plays this correctly. So many triggers. But next turn we equip on the angel and we just swing with yeah. that every single just turn. Way. I mean, to be honest, mind slaver took a huge chunk out of that. Pure coins. Oh, he's scooped. Well, thanks. So he, 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 he should have never scooped, to be honest. He should have never scooped because of yeah. time. We definitely want Dismember. I'm not sure if we want Squelch against the Sacrifice. No, we don't. It, it just, it just conjures the Scry. It's not good. Spell's I think guide. we want the Negate. Huh? What do you want the Negate for? For the company? Company, yeah. I think Remount is pretty poor in this, in this uh, matchup. So because he's only playing those little tiny creatures, also Chalice, ugh, I don't like it too much. Yeah, Chalice is horrible, I think. Ostone is not that great. <laughs> no, I, I think Ostone is good. Eaterize seems nice, I think. What do you think it's of Wonka Engine? Dead. Yeah, Wonka Engine, of course. So he would board out Remand yeah. and bring in the gate. I, I understand that reasoning and I, I think it's okay. I think, like, with Return to Ancestors and Rally, the something and what, what, uh, you know, the whole Return and Collected Company things, Negate is really good against that. No. I think the Dismember is pretty, pretty obvious. I think Eugene is amazing. I, I'm not sure how good Sunrain Titan is. I mean, he's free mana, but. Nah, let Sunrain Titan. You can't board out too many threats, though. No, I would board in Vomka Engine. I see. I'm not boarding out any threats so far. Um, oh, you're okay. Well, I think I want to play the spells guide against Path, maybe even. Yeah. Well, I'm not so sure about that one. Can you steal uh, triggers from an offensor with uh, with spells guide? I don't think so. Let me check the card. Combined knowledge here. I think I'm gonna play like it is right now. No, choose a creature with the least toughness among creatures you control. It's not a valid target. No. So yeah, I'm I'm thinking about adding Etherize or Spell Sky, but I don't see a card I want to cut. So I think we're just gonna play it like it is. Yeah, just go with it. And time out. <laughs> <laughs> I think one of Chalos or one of Spells Guide should definitely make it in the deck well against Path. Yeah. Because I will if... be more I will be more silent now. I'm just shout No, it's it's anything. it's just we're arguing so much and I don't yeah. it's not your fault. I, this is a keep, obviously. This is a keep, yeah. Because we could have a turn three Bonka engine here. Probably turn four because we play turn one. Or not turn one but turn two on. Awesome. Well There we go. Now our map gets decayed. Probably not, but it could be happening. Do we, we just go for turn three, right? No, we don't. What? No, we don't. Because he has path. Then you get your six mana island. You have negate the hard counter to path in your hand. Like, just protect it. So, well, whatever. I, I would have not played this way. I would have played tower in turn three of Wonka Engine. And if he has path, then I'm... Okay, fine, you have path. He doesn't even have a white source. No, he will. If he plays on a fence, now we lose. No, never mind. He still needs to persist. So do, do should I get the mine now or anticipate? Yeah, yeah. Get the mine. Okay. Just play it a bit slower. Why? Just don't, don't slam yeah, because you don't slam the Wonkal engine. Yeah, it's your only threat in hand. That's obvious now. <laughs> you throw the mine. Awesome. So I can't even do it next turn. I have to wait until turn turn five. Yeah. 
See, there's the white sauce. <clears throat> but now, if you jammed, this would be the turn if you jammed uh, Worm Can Engine. It would be puffed. Yeah, so, but you wouldn't be winning. And then next turn, we maybe, I don't know, anticipate into something and win. I still think my line of play would have been better. Um, I would say Condescend. Um, I don't first or Condescend, obviously. Yeah. What do you think? I Condescend, obviously, because yeah. if you play on a fender, we want to we want to Condescend, and we're gonna have so much mana next turn. Yeah. That Condescend is really good. But also play a second blue source. No, the turn after, we do that. Okay. No, I definitely want to have mana to Condescend as much as possible, or even repeal if we want to. So yeah, next turn I play blue swords and I play Wonka Engine and I have Negate open. Yeah. Do I repeal here? Oh, uh, you can do. This yeah. guy, just to draw a card. Sure. And if he sacks, I'm okay with that. I yeah. trade repeal as removal, basically. Repeal turns into, I don't know, kind of dismember or something. And if he doesn't, it's we could even... company here. That's the only incentive. Yes. Oh, Spellburst. Okay, boys, we got this. Yeah, but I'm gonna play Wormcrow Engine still, right? No, you can play Tower of Wormcrow Engine. That's, that's true, that's true. <laughs> I did not think about that, but that's true. Okay. So now, he plays Path, and he will have... Come on, you wanna do it? Or he plays... Company. If he plays company now and the next turn. So, do I call him for one? I don't know. Um, this is hard. I think I call him for one. Yeah, do it. You're gonna scry into, into something else. Yeah. If he puffs. I want to negate still. And Spellburst can take care of creatures. Bottom, bottom. Yeah. You always want to lead with the soft counters, like Spellburst and yep. Gate are hard counters. Far more val valuable. Okay, I think our opponent is not... If he plays Path now, then he would be genius in my eyes, because he baited out our counter. <laughs> he played his Stony Silence. This does basically nothing. No, if he, if he, if he draws Expedition Map now, it's useless. <laughs> no. Oh man, you're so bad at drawing cards, it's insane. Um, if we attack, he's just gonna sack, but... He can't, yeah, he can sack, but I don't know. Just attack. Make him sack two creatures. Because he can't counter everything he plays now. Yeah, but he can still attack us. He sacks something, we lose one life. When he attacks for three, we go to nine. Yeah, we're gonna counter everything he plays. How is our time? Eight minutes, okay. We have to win this game. <laughs> In this deck, I don't see how Condescend is a soft counter. It is. It is. It is. Yeah. If you tap out for, like, Platinum Angel or Eugene or Southern Titan, it becomes a soft counter very, very fast. This interaction is so mean, like, that you can sack the blocker and you don't get the lifelink. That's so mean. Yeah. Uh, sure. No, Whatever. I, that's another okay. thing you can sack. Okay. You have enough mana anyway. Exactly. And we want to show, we want to establish dominance. Yeah. Actually, if you, you play so, I think you thought this was still a two-two, and that it would be a one-one now that which could attack, which could block. No. Oh, he has returned to the ranks or something? No, no not for one mana. Ma no. What's going on here? Oh no. Do I play equip to gain no, ten I life? Don't. I don't know. No, no you yeah. don't. We can't because of Stony Silence is the right answer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're right. But I, I think I'm gonna play right. I'm, I'm gonna play with better skull. Yeah. Do it. It's unlikely that he draws two cards. He, he draws another card. Well, he's cried, right? <laughs> oh no, he's cried. Yeah, he's, 
he's cracked five times. So blood out hits doesn't really change anything, but we could. I mean, we're gonna counter anything just because even if he, anything. even because if we can't, he, even if he uses this to bait us into tapping, and he has a path now for Vomkenj, we still have better skull, and we still have negate. All right. And boy, and you you were worried about the time. There's still like three <laughs> matches worth of time there. <laughs> oh jeez. Um, what is this deck called? Uh, next level Epson. It's called. Next level Epson. Are you sure? Um, I'm I'm not too sure about this version, but next level Epson plays all the small creatures, and then you can sack them obviously away, and you play Epson Ascension, and just. Like imagine a board where you have five tiny creatures and you drop the ascension, they all get plus one plus one, then you attack, then attack them all away. It's, you can do unfair things. I'm gonna call this Absan combo. Yeah, yeah it's fine. <laughs> I think people are gonna gonna know roughly what I mean with that, right? He's probably on a budget, I think. Budget? No, I'm not gonna fit budget in there. It's already so yeah. big. That's what she said. <laughs> I, like I, I I'm, I'm not I'm it, it, no I'm gonna put budget in there because it reads now like we we didn't get a free win I mean it wasn't a free win but I mean it was budget <laughs> I don't want to be condescending towards my opponent he doesn't deserve that Basically, although although and, and, he did throw away game one he could have just triple triple blocked and, yeah. and won the game and that's why I I said can we attack here and you just said yeah attack and I did it <laughs> it was horrible if if, if he Love. knew. If he knew how his deck works, he would have won that game. Sometimes you have to bluff, man. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe, it really helps us out. You can find us on Twitter at MagicGathStrat, Facebook slash MagicGatheringStrat, or on the web MagicGatheringStrat.com. There you can find articles and free prize supported leagues. This is all brought to you by our Patreons and CardHoarder.com. If you enjoy this content, please consider supporting us at patreon.com slash magicgatheringstrat.